All right, guys, welcome to episode 57 of Dope Talk TV. Is yours truly low key? Got John here with me, got Toby and Tori in the back, Milo and Maddie yeah, yeah. running around. We're back with another one. We appreciate everybody that's liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. Don't forget to thumbs up, like, hit that notification bell, and let us know if you're rocking, man. But yeah, Johnny, how you feeling today? Feeling good, feeling good. I'm chilling. We got the new, you know, little mic little cover right yeah, here. yeah we got the new mic man we trying to get some new shit so you know bang wink wink let us know now nah, let real. us know you nah, know we, what i'm saying we like to drink bang you know yeah, what I'm saying? we, we actually, don't like to bang we, but we like to drink yeah, bang. Fa- well i mean i like to bang i like too, to bang too but you know but that's women. a different story yeah. yeah yeah that's a different story yeah but yeah uh yeah man starting off straight with the shits bro today we're we're here to liven up the mood a little bit and I, it's just something that i've been wondering for a couple years now it's been you know it's been kind of bothering me what's going on i don't know man i i don't think that strippers are real dancers i mean how you I, feel about it i don't like how do you even sign like how do you even qualify <laughs> to become a dancer? Like do you just go in there, you shake your ass and you're like, or do you just need a fat ass or like Hey man. I don't know, but <laughs> I, don't I don't know what the qualifications are. Yeah. There is a difference between a stripper dance and an actual dancer. Um no, I really don't I feel like that it doesn't really count. Now, yeah, when I think of dancing, I think of like salsa dancing, bachata, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Merengue or like ballroom. Not even that, yeah, just ballroom or you know like actually dancing i'm not gonna say i'm not gonna take away from from you know from you strippers out there that like do it because you do have talent bro mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying not yeah. everybody can get up on the pole you you know you gotta be athletic you gotta be you gotta have some you gotta type have of some, talent yeah but to sit here and call you a full-blown dancer it's like get the fuck out nah, of here. Nah, nah, you ain't no dancer. Show me some ballroom <laughs> dancing. Show me some show, show me, me that some ballet. Nah, show me the ballerina spin. Show me a fucking spin on your fucking nah, one nah. toe. Dancers, bro. dancers have fucked up feet. Let me see your feet. Yeah, for real. <laughs> nah, they really do. They do, bro. They do. Like their nails and their up. toes are curled yeah, the fuck the ballerina up. Ballerina feet. Oh yeah. my god. That's hideous. That's yeah. fucked up. It is fucked up. That's, That's fucking fucked disgusting. Up. Yeah, but y'all, go down in the comments and let us know how y'all feel about it. If you think that strippers are real dancers, if they're not. You know what I'm saying? I don't think so. You know, just because you like no. shake your ass in a certain way to, you know, nah, nah, a nah. song. Like. I mean, um, I remember I called a stripper a stripper and she got pissed. She's like, I'm a fucking dancer. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, shit. All right. Uh, so and ever baby, since then. I met you at the strip club last time I checked. Not on fucking Broadway. Nah, bro. Check yourself. Nah, they fucking robbed my ass in Miami. You remember that? Bro. <laughs> my dog got robbed with no gun. Bro, I got my robbed. My dog got a half a dance. Bro, half a fucking dance, bro. It, it was a and Russian cost, girl too. She and came it up to me. Cost a hundred fucking dollars. A hundred dollars. I mean, it, he did look smooth. I will give him that. He nah, looked smooth. I looked smooth. When she grabbed his hand and took off with him. Yeah, in front like of a, my mom. I looked, went to the strip club with my yeah, mom. Yeah, bro, that that was actually like a fucking like yeah, a G move. It was. Your mom came out for real. Like, yeah. Now like, nah, we out. Nah, my mom went with us <laughs> and she didn't give a fuck. Your uncle was there too, but Yo, he, he was he drunk was as about fuck. to fight that one nigga trying to sell us some bullshit. Nah, that was nah, trash. Facts. That was with your uncle, bro. Nah, he was, was pissed because I tipped him five dollars. He thought it was a fifty. He's like, "What the fuck? How do we even get that much?" He was fucking pissed. Shout out Theo Edward, man. Yo, bro, love you, bro. Real talk. But yeah, bro, something that's a, a little bit more controversial, bro, is something that we feel a certain way about, something I feel a certain way about for sure, and that's that, to me, bro, there's only two sexes out here, bro. There's only male and female. All mm-hmm. this other bullshit that people feel like, in my opinion, bro, I don't think it's, you know what I'm saying? I I, I just don't buy it, man. No, like, no. I mean, listen, I know some personal, I know some people, like, on a business side that are actually, like... They're trans. Mm-hmm. And I had no idea. I really had no idea. Um, there was actually a couple times, you know, on the internet, like on Instagram, I was looking through some pictures. Some girl followed me. I was like, wow, it looks like a woman, bro. And it was a man, bro. No, yeah, it happens. It was a man. It happens. But to sit here and, like, say that that's a woman, like, even if you have a sex operation, brother, like, like your genetics say that you're a man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you can't, you don't have... The je- the reproductive organs of a woman, you don't go through the menstrual cycle that a woman goes through. Like, I mean, as fucked up as it sounds, bro. Like, that's just my personal opinion on it. I just, it, to me, bro, there's only male, female, no. and everything else is something. Like, if you, if that's how you want to identify, bro, that's cool. Live your life. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But 
where I've always had the problem is like, why am I subject? Like, why do I have to call you a woman if I don't feel like that? Yeah, you like, know what I'm saying. Yeah, and like, they got offended. They, they, I, bro, there was one of these. That it was in the beginning when we first started. We we had an episode with Jay, mm -hmm. and we were speaking about how the trans were. Uh, they should be part of the Olympics, and I and I feel like that's bullshit. I don't feel like that's fair. Okay, like if a man, yeah, no, nah, yeah, it's not a, fair. If a, listen, man, if a twenty-two-year-old woman has to wrestle a twenty-three-year-old man that's that had a sex operation, yeah, like that's not that's nowhere near fair. It's not. Like and I don't believe like, in that. You're gonna you're gonna get dominated now. If you guys want to start your own Olympics, cool. You like, can start your own you know, shit. Yeah, or like trans people wrestle trans people, bro. I'm have gonna, a ball. Yeah, I'm gonna. Teach, no pun intended. I'm gonna teach but. my kid. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna teach my kid. At the end of the day, if you guys, you know, all my trans people that are watching, you know, if you don't like what we're saying, then just click the unfollow button yeah, and just bro, get yeah, the fuck like, out of here. For real, like y'all could for fucking uh, go somewhere else. Because at the end of the day, we love everybody, bro. It's yeah. not like we we don't hate people. We don't go out there like. You know, just saying crazy shit to people and just disrespecting. You know, we were raised right. We have manners. Yeah. But we also have our own fucking beliefs. And if you don't believe in what we believe in and you can't respect it, then fuck out of here. We don't really go. Yeah, fuck. I'm going to teach my kid and at the end of the day to treat everybody with respect. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to teach my kid from right and wrong. Right. You know what I mean? Like, this is not okay. Right. You know? And, um, and that's just how we feel, bro. Like, yeah. it's the same. Like, that's why it's like it goes both ways, bro. Like you guys have the right to feel the way you do, and we have the right to feel the way we do, and mm -hmm. raise our kids the way we want to raise our kids, yeah. and you know implement like certain morals that we feel are the right way. Because yeah. you can't tell somebody else how to raise their fucking kid. Bro. Oh, and then like people you know be like, saying? "Oh, like, karma," and you know it's gonna happen to your kid probably one day. That's fine. And if it does happen, hey, I love my I'll kid. Love my kid the same way. When my know? kid, yeah, I love my kid regardless, but. You're going to come to my household with respect. You're not going to come bring another fucking individual and hold hands and kiss in front of, you know, other little children that could be in my household and confuse them. That's right. not going to be, that's not, no. I'm not going to go to your, I'm not going to yeah, go to your no, marriage. Like, I'm, I'm not, not going to go to your you wedding. dresses and buy you a purse yeah. and all this other shit. I'm not like, going to go to your wedding. I'm not going to, I'm not going to do any of that. Listen, I have, I would have no problem with my child being gay, bro. You know, a lot of parents are like, oh, you know, like they would feel a certain way. Yeah. I really wouldn't give a fuck. Yeah. But the thing is, you're not going to subject me to t calling you a woman when you were born a male. Yeah. You're not going to subject me to buying you like purses and, and shit like that. Like, if that's what you want to do, bro, cool. But you, you can't force other people to like live the, the way you want to live. Yeah. Because that's not their fucking lifestyle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And. Like like we said, bro, once again, it's not like we're trying to hurt anybody's feelings, but this is just the way we feel. If you agree, go down in the comments and let us I mean, know. If you don't, go down in the comments and let us know, too, why you don't agree like or whatever. You yeah. know, like we're not. I think it's unnatural. People. Yeah, it's not something that happens. It's not happens normal. too often in nature, bro. You don't see male gorillas turning themselves into female gorillas and, mm, no. full, you know, going on into other animals. Like, you just don't see that in nature. Yeah. yeah. We're the only animal that, like. I just feel like our brain, like we have, we, we have too much going on in our fucking brain and we haven't figured it out. And we, we just do, we experiment, we do crazy shit, you know? Mm -hmm. And it's like, I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe we've gotten to the point where we're that bored in, in, in society. Like we're that bored in the world where like people are just out I'm, there. I'm going to call, out. I'm going to call these people weirdos in my opinion. Yeah, like that, like, like these people are weirdos. I, I'm not holding anything back. Like y'all could say whatever you want about me. But my opinion about it, man, like, I just, I don't fuck with it. I don't like it. I don't think it's okay. Um, whenever I see somebody like that that's dressed like a woman, I, I, I honestly feel uncomfortable. Yeah. And then, you like, know? it's not so much that I feel uncomfortable, man. Like, what makes me fucking, like, what makes me feel uncomfortable, if that's what you want to, how I would word it, is, like, if I say, man, if, or if I say, sir, is this going to turn into a fucking thing? Right now? Yeah. Like, if you hand me something, I'm like, yo, thank you, man. Oh, I'm not a man. It's like, that's where it comes, like, it becomes That's actually happened like, to me. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Like, yeah. it's just, I'm I'm being cordial. Yeah. You know, I'm being cordial. I said, thank you, brother. Like, have you woke I look up? at you as, like, a man. You know what I'm saying? It, I don't it, know. That's it's, happened to me. When, remember when I used to work for Spectrum? I was on the phone. And it sounded like a man. Right. And then you said, thank you, sir. And, and I said, thank you, sir. And it was a woman. <laughs> And she got off. She started going off on me. I was like, listen, how can you be mad at me 
okay? You sound like a man. I can't physically see you. Like, I don't know. It's just crazy how soft these people are. Yeah, and facts. they think it's like, they look at us like we're wrong. Yeah, you know no, what I mean? And it's for like, not accepting like shit that isn't really fucking natural. If you're like, a man and you turn into a woman and you can have a baby. Oh, bro, you're fucking... Then come fucking talk to yeah, me. Like we can that, make it no, different. Like, and if there is, then fucking congrats. I still think it's fucking weird. So, uh, listen, man. That's just what it is. That's yeah, my opinion. Facts. John's opinion. You know facts. what I mean? So, um, go down in the comments and let us know if you agree or disagree with what we just said, man. But I agree with you, bro. Like, it's just that shit's weird. It's just it's, weird. It's to me. weird. To yeah. Me, but, but yeah, man. Another fucking su subject I wanted to talk about is the '70s bush versus the trimmed garden. The trim garden or the landing or fucking strip. Or the motherfucking landing strip. What would you rather have, bro? What's the craziest design you've ever seen on a chick's pubes? Uh, it was a landing strip. And it was honestly... That's it? A landing yeah, strip? That, that was it. That was, was pretty normal, yeah. Yeah, but I actually have a friend that said one time he saw... He had a landing strip on a girl. And he saw it. And he just... He felt like throwing up. Oh, my God. And I was like, man, it's not really a big deal. Like, I kind of I mean, like it, it depends on how long it is, bro. No, it was pretty long. They said... Oh, it's, yeah. <laughs> So he said. Fucking. He said. He said from from the from the from the puss all the way up to the fucking to, to the, the fucking to the belly button, man. You had a trail. You had to find that bitch down there. Nah, That's hell gross. Nah. Yo, listen, man. Leave the seventies in the seventies. I feel like I feel like it's common courtesy to be trimmed up and be you know be uh, be landscaped down there. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, exactly. yeah, have some fucking respect for your partner, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I don't even want to go talk about hygiene, bro. There was one time, bro, like <laughs> it smelled like a goddamn sea world in this bitch. Bro, that's bad. And it was horrible. And it was horrible. I mean, like you don't have the fucking courtesy or respect to clean up. I mean, we got a shower. It actually even, happened at bro, your house. It's not even a shower, it happened, bro. It, it happened at his house. Damn bro, it. Bro, listen. If a puss is smelling that bad, my nigga, that's like a yeast infection. That's some shit. She needs to go to the doctor. It's either that, drink some more water, clean listen, up. Listen, bro, you're... Something's off balance. Something's not there. Your Something, pH levels off balance. Something's off. Don't get but me wrong. You need to go to the fucking. If it's smelling bad, like yeah. like it's actually smelling like fish and shit, but yeah. it's not good. Yeah. Like every body parts have a certain odor. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. pussy has a certain odor. Yeah. Where it's like, but there's a limit, nigga. Like you, like <laughs> you can't. But don't ever fucking dive in some shit. It was one time. Like yeah, she blamed it on me. She said, "No, nah, it was you." Nah, and I was like, "No, no, no, no." Listen, like I understand. My house. I understand. I have a scent and I smell sometimes. But like before, I have any type of intercourse with anybody, or even if even if I I have a a thought of like maybe kissing a girl. Yeah. I, it's put some mouthwash. Put, yeah. put a piece of gum in your mouth, bro. Before you leave the house, when you're getting ready, bro, take a shower. You know what I'm saying? Put some deodorant on. Brush your teeth. Facts. When you, you know, put a piece of gum in. Yeah. Like, go... F t hygiene is important, bro. You ever see those people that come stay over your house or you stay over their house? Or, let me let me scratch that. They stay over your house. Mm -hmm. And they don't... They bring everything in the fucking world but a fucking toothbrush. Oh, my And you wonder God, why... Bro. How the fuck... Like, it's like, my nigga, look, bro. That's like... That's like 101. If you come over my house and you pull out fucking face lotion before you pull out a toothbrush, bitch, you got your priorities fucked up. Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, come on, man. Take care of that mouthpiece. Take care like, of that dome. Take care of everything, man. You got to take care of everything, bro. Like, that's just the way I think, man. Nah, Some facts. people think it's like, oh, like, you know, it's nothing, you know, whatever. It's just a body odor. Like, Sway. Sway just says, oh, everybody yeah, else is smells like, nah, nigga. Everybody don't smell like a foot. But shout out to Sway, bro. I love that guy. He's fucking, yeah. he's more into the natural fucking wilderness yeah. fucking type of thing. Like, he'd rather you know, have a cool. bush. Yeah, he definitely, oh, no, nah, Sway has a bush, bro. Yeah, Sway does have a bush. He has to have a fucking bush. I know that Toby has like, a bush. That smells like the fucking Yukon. Toby has a bush, right, Toby? <laughs> <laughs> Toby, you got a bush, bro? Yeah, he... You got a bush or you what? Got a bush or a landing strip? What do you got? Oh no no no! He got a he got a bush. My dog got a landing strip from his belly button down to his fucking shit too, bro. Nah, that's trash. You know what else is trash that I noticed, man? That's been going on with this whole Corona shit. The movie exactly. theaters, you know, they're back open now. Well, yeah. I don't know about everybody else because every state is different, but they opened everything back up. Bro, Florida don't give a fuck, and we don't. They, they don't give a shit we about out. us. Like yeah, we're we done here. with this quarantine bullshit. Like yeah. 
like, like I get it. We could keep up. it maybe seats apart. You know, you know what I mean. We could just keep it separate. You no, know? we, you know, we wear masks sometimes, and you know, whatever. Yeah. Not really. I don't really wear masks unless I really fucking have to, bro. Because yeah, like, it's annoying, man. Like, yeah. And it's like, I don't know. I've I've always been a firm believer that whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen. You can't fucking stop that shit. Facts. If it happens, right. it happens. Yeah, you, you can try to prevent it. it, but hey, it is what it is. Yeah. But my bad, bro. What were you saying uh, about the movie? Yeah, games? the the. The drive-in movie theaters, man. Like, just compared to, like, the regular movie theater. Yeah, I just don't like just... it. The only thing what? that I like about it. Oh, no, you fucking The only bugging. thing I like about it is that you could hotbox in the car. Hotbox. You could probably have some dome in the car. Come but you know what? On, I've man. gotten it's dome in the movie fu- theater. I mean, yeah, but it's in your own car, bro. Yeah, I know. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a whole fucking vibe. It's cool. Like, nah, it's- I- I don't know, bro. See, yeah, see, cool. that's what we we yeah. think different. Now. Nah, like, man. My dog Fuck rather the drive my through. dog rather walk in, stuff a fucking Hershey's bar up his gooch to sneak it in and fucking go sit in the movie theater. I'd rather just sit in my fucking car with a little, you know, what I'm saying, dime piece next to me, get some dome or yeah. whatever, or yeah. man, you know, just watch the movie if it's the vibe. Yeah. But I feel like I don't know. Driving movie theaters are, to me. It's the move above. Yeah, the snacks above are way, the walking. The snacks are way too expensive. They say most of the I've profit. Never Bought a fuck it, bro. Most That's of their pro- <laughs> most of their profit comes from snacks, well, and I believe. I don't it. know how. I believe no, it. No, I do. But it's twelve dollars for a sprite. It's one hundred and twelve dollars for fucking three three people to fucking have some popcorn and a drink, bro. Nah, it's crazy. Nah, I see how trash. they can make their money off that shit. Yeah, but yeah. I'm not paying. I'm, I'm gonna pay for the movie ticket. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, and I'm gonna bring me a female that got a bag. <laughs> okay. Full of everything. We just hit the dollar store, my G. You yeah, feel me? I've That's the that. move. You got, bro. Go, y'all go down in the comments and let me know that y'all know. Y'all know what I'm fucking talking about. Yeah, you yeah. gotta hit the Dollar Tree, hit the fucking candy out, get the uh, everything you Man, need, bro. I'm $20. eating the candy corn. Fuck out of here. Fuck a candy corn. But twenty dollars, you'll be chilling in the movie theaters. No fucking no no cap. No for cap real. for real for real. Um, but yeah, the tickets are like what like. Ten dollars. They're not the tickets aren't bad. Yeah, I mean, the it depends ain't. on where you go. Sometimes they're ten, sometimes they're twenty, yeah. twenty five. You know, it depends on the movie theater. But the snacks are always one hundred fifty dollars and up. Like them shits are fucking like a bag of Skittles is like fourteen ninety five. Not for real. Now they got liquor. They got a bar in the movie theater now. And imagine I went oh, in there for a Jack and Coke. God. And guess how much the Jack and Coke was? That shit like was like seven eight dollars. Seventeen dollars for a double. A seventeen dollar <laughs> double, <laughs> bitch! I'll go get a fucking bottle, bro, for twenty five bucks. Nah, for real, that shit crazy, bro. That shit's trash. Nah, bro, but I've been thinking a lot lately, bro. You know, you just turned twenty five not too long ago. I turned twenty six not too long ago. We're in our mid twenties, and I just be thinking about all the fucking shit that we used to talk. When we were teenagers about, oh, when I'm 25, I'm going to have a fucking Lambo <laughs> and be in a mansion and we're fucking broke making a fucking yeah. podcast yeah, that's doing funny. nothing. That's funny how you say that because Kevin, bro, Kevin just graduated high school. They're like, oh, I'm not going to be you. All right. You know, all right. All Until right. you are us and then you're asking us how we He's like, became he's like, I'm going to go into college right after high school. I'm going to have a good job. Hey, I'm like, buddy. bro, you got to start from the bottom, buddy. Buddy, you we gotta were start all the there, and guess what, bro? You're not going to college. Man. You're not. <laughs> once, you, once you go, <laughs> he said you ain't going to college. No, no, bro. And it's not nothing because Kevin, Kevin's a smart guy. Shout yeah. out to Kevin, man. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah, a facts. smart. He's yeah. a smart guy, bro. He's not a dumb kid he's at not. all by no. any means. But no. like, that's why he won't because he's not a dumb. kid kid he's yeah. gonna think about it and be like bro, why he's gonna go for fuck? a couple years maybe yeah he might get his associates and then be like fuck this nigga uh, i just paid how much for this piece of paper yeah that i can't even get a job with that's how he feels about his high school diploma all right wait till you <laughs> get your associates <laughs> and they tell you that everybody else and their fucking mom has an associate yeah what else can you do can, what you, else can, can you, you juggle can you pogo, your nuts can you pogo while you fucking juggle <laughs> can you juggle your nuts <laughs> i don't fucking think so so next <laughs> So that's how it's Man, that's how it is, bro. Like that's just how nah, it is. Nah, but teenage dreams, man, for real. Like nah, you, used to, like you used to dream so big. Be an astronaut. Then, <laughs> stupid shit. <laughs> stupid shit, right? Yo, shout out to the people that are I'll really be doing there, it. Have though. a fucking Def Jam. Yeah. Don't be like, fucking running the radio station, and then you're like, bro. It's oh. one out of like a million people that happens. Listen, too. man, you gotta either have the connection or the work, the work ethic. 
That's either yeah. It, work or ethic. Both, work ethic saying? beats talent. Yeah, work ethic beats talent any day of the fucking week, bro. And that's why, man, like, you got to keep certain friends around you, bro. Like, this fucking guy, guys, if you don't know this guy right here, we go through it. We go fucking through no, it. We behind fight every day. Cameras. Like, it's a love hate relationship. This is like my little brother. Sometimes I want to put my hands on him, sometimes I want to give him a hug. Yeah. But. Sometimes I want to punch him in the face. Sometimes I want to punch him in the nuts. You know what I mean? It's, it is what it is. it's hate, hate for me. No, nah, <laughs> fuck this thing. Out of you. But nah, bro, it's like, like we hold each other accountable, and like we, when we start slipping in certain things, like the other day we had a conversation where he was like, "Bro, you got to tighten up with certain shit. Start sharing more. Start getting more, you know, involved with the with the dope talk page, and just you know, just tighten up." And it's like. I feel like it's important to have friends like that around you, bro, mm -hmm. because it it keeps steel sharp and steel. You know, it keeps you it keeps check. you in line. Yeah. It keeps you in check, and we all need that shit from time to time, bro. Like today, I had to fucking check this guy, fucking showing up late. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It happens. It shouldn't. Be. It shouldn't fucking happen a hundred times in a row. Yeah. But it. I guess it fucking does. Yeah. But there was a turtle on the road. There was a turtle on the road. He had to stop to look at a fucking snake in a bush. <laughs> he had to fucking like, get the fuck out nah, of here. Nah, that was earlier today. <laughs> fuck out of here. Fuck out of here, bitch. Nah, there was a snake in my bush. <laughs> Speaking of bushes, <laughs> I had a snake in my bush that earlier, bro. Had a snake in that bitch. His nah. mom's looking at you from the other nah, side. I got a snake in my bush right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Show her a snake in the yeah, bush. Yeah, yeah. Fuck out of nah, here. Nah, fuck out of here, bro. Guys, it's it's 2020. About to be 2021. Shave your bush. Bro. Shave your bush and you're good. Don't be disrespectful to your female, man. Yeah. Real shit. Well. But yeah, it. man. We've been back with another one. We appreciate everybody that's liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. Don't forget to do just that. Facts. Thumbs up. Like. Share, subscribe, thumbs up. Because let most, us know in the comments, man. Most of the people I checked the percentage. Yeah, I'll like pull up the percentage right here. Percent, bro. I'm telling you, most of the people that are watching our videos are not subscribed. Are not subscribed. So what the fuck are you doing? So Bobby? why are you even what here? What are you doing, Bobby? You watch this, but you don't want to support. Get the fuck press, out of here. Press the red button. Press the uh, what is it? A bell? It's a yeah, bell hit button. Hit the notification bell and set it to all. Hit and all. click it. If you're you know not going to subscribe. Don't watch the video. Yeah, facts. Just leave. Listen, man, we're, we're we're authentic motherfuckers. We don't like fake support, all right? So if you ain't going to really support, get the fuck out of here. Get the step in mind. We got a goal next month. Facts. We want that percentage to be different. Facts. So everybody subscribe. Click on it. We got new merch on the way. Facts. It's dropping. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. We love you guys. Peace. Peace.